everyone, this is MJ and you are at my channel called Reading This Life. My channel is where we talk fiction, friends, and fun. Today, I'm going to tell you why I don't have a TBR. Stay tuned. And remember before we get started to like this video. Let me know, are you a TBR person or are you a mood person? I would be really interested to find out. Okay, so we're just gonna have a chit chat. Let's have a story time. Let's have everybody come on in. Let's get cozy, let's get cozy. You wanna get cozy with MJ? Okay, here we go. All right, so um, I wore my Moody sweatshirt just for this occasion. And yeah, so the history of my reading is basically whimsical. It's whatever I am called to read. Whatever I get a vibe about a book, that's the book that I'm going to read. In essence, every book that is in my home is on my TBR, if I haven't read it yet. Bottom line, it's just when do I feel like reading that book? Um, when it comes to life, there are so many rules, there are so many regulations, there are so many laws, there are so many things that we have to make sure of, um, that we have to be certain of, and we have to do things in order. You follow a recipe, you have to do it in order. Um, you know, so many, so many things in life that you can use that analogy for. Um, for my reading, no rules, no rules at all. It is whatever is calling me, whatever I'm in the mood for. And I mean, truly, truly in the mood. I can't tell you how many times um, I would be reading a book and I would find another book and I would put down that book to pick up another book. That's just me. That's how I roll. That's how I operate. The Ninth House is a book that I started a year ago. And I put it down and I picked it up last month to finish it. That's me. You know, some people that would infuriate, that would irritate and that would drive them crazy. But for me, it's just, you know, it's just, I wasn't in the mood for it. That's all. Um, so how do I pick what I'm going to read? What do I feel like reading? It's the bottom line. I don't have I don't have a set schedule. I'm not going to say, well, I'm going to read this, 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 and this. I have an idea, but then different things pop in, right? So last week I had my reading all planned out and then a lovely friend and subscriber and fellow booktuber sent me this. And I'm like, I gotta read that. I need to read this book right now. So it moves to the top of the list and I put something else, else back and down. Um, I have my books here. I have a, a bookcase downstairs and I have my mood trolley because it's a mood trolley. If I feel like reaching for a long arm Western, that's what I'm going to do. If I feel like reaching for a play, that's what I'm going to do. It's just how I roll. Now, if I am committed to a buddy read or group read, I am committed to that. The Four Winds is a recent book that I read with um, uh, some fellow booktubers and I wanted to put it down because I got this in the mail, but I didn't. And I stayed the course with it, even though I was like, oh, I just want to put this down and read the other book. Um, I just decided not to. But there is no there is no rhyme or reason. It's just what am I in the mood to read? That's it. And I find that there's no stress with worrying about reading. Um, there's no, you know, right now, I don't know when, I don't know when um, my life is going to end. So I'm sure if I did, I may put some things to the top of the list, but I'm, I'm really just, just going with energy and what I feel like and, you know, what vibes with me at that time. That's it. It's that simple. There's no stress. There's no fuss. I just don't want the added pressure of a TBR. I, I don't want to set a set stack of books for the month and then really get on myself or down about myself or feel guilty that I'm not where I should be with my reading. I want, reading is fun. Reading is supposed to be fun. And when I see people out there that have TBRs, 
But then in their videos say, I wasn't in the mood or I'm not in the mood for that book or I was a little bit of a mood reader. Mm -hmm. I see you. I see you and I know exactly what you're talking about. Um, I welcome mood readers. I welcome all readers, but mood readers, we have a certain thing. We got a style, we got a vibe, we have our own rules. It's no rules, baby. So yeah, so that's basically, that's basically it. I don't need more rules in my life. I don't have a TBR, bottom line. All my books are considered to be on a TBR. It's just where are they positioned based on my mood? Do you agree? Let me know. I just have so many books in my home like, I don't have a ton. I probably have, since I started BookTube, maybe 500, maybe. Um, and I just love, love, love looking at them and seeing them and thinking about when I'm going to read them and looking at them and reminding myself, ooh, I haven't read you yet. Maybe I should, you know, and just... It's just fascinating. I just love it. You know, and if you're, we're all here for the same reasons. We're all here because of BookTube. Uh, we're all here because of our love of books. And I'm sure you can all agree with me that there's nothing better than just picking a book and settling in and starting something new. It's just, just amazing. It's amazing the adventures that we get to go on. So that is my little spiel about why I don't have a TBR. I'd be interested to know if you have a TBR or if you are a mood reader like me. Let me know down below. Um, yeah, so that's basically it. Eh, it's just a quick video. All right, everyone, get back to what you're reading. Don't forget, I am going to be um, doing sprints, reading sprints, if you'd like to join me. Uh, be sure to check out lives. Be sure to ring the bell, get notified as to when I go live. Um, usually sprints are on the weekends or any days off, so... It could be fun. All right. I hope you are taking care of yourself so you can take care of others. And I will see you in my next video, whether it be sooner or later. So until next time, everyone, goodbye for now.